Hello everyone and welcome to this rainy day of dog craft. So I am here with, as always, my Minecraft versions of my real life dogs, Paige and Molly. We've got my cats, Milk Toast and Stampy. And today we are going to be figuring out what is wrong with Paige. She's been staying in this bed for several episodes now. She's been looking a little fuller, lazy, uh, slothful, eating a lot. Um, I'm kind of worried about her. So we're, we're going we're gonna to dedicate this episode to figuring out Paige's problem. Uh, however, uh, first I want to start the episode as I always do by going up to the Dalmatian plantation and breeding another puppy uh, to add to our wall. So we're breeding 101 Dalmatians up here, naming them after subscribers. And today we are going to be adding, let me breed Perdita and Pongo, conveniently located right here. Uh, today we're going to be adding S. Turner. And that is because she uploaded a hilarious video to YouTube of her with her pet who is also named Stacy, named after me, and it is a pet praying mantis, uh, which was so funny. If you are watching this as Turner, you are so funny, so beautiful, so silly. I'm gonna play a little bit of the video right this now. Stacy, and uh, Stacy, you can't. Stacy, Stacy, Stacy. Come here. Anyway, that video made my day, so I am happy to add you to the Dalmatian Plantation. There you are, and uh, it's getting rather, rather full in here, isn't it? Huh. Well, as they say, the more the merrier, so I think that, uh, uh, I don't know, if we're going to be able to get 101 up here, we already have only, only 40 or 38, so if you can imagine by the time we get 101, whoo! Uh, okay, I was hoping that the weather would clear up. Uh, let's go ahead and go and look at the art and then try to figure out what is going on with our dog, Paige. Um, all right, so, oh, wait, what is, what is this? Not feeling very well. Bring donuts and pork pie, please, Paige. Uh, okay. Paige? You want donuts and pork pie. Huh. Alright, that's that's a pretty odd request. Uh, I actually did install a bakery mod, because if you remember in the last episode, we completed our dog biscuit barkery uh, right down there. And I was going to use that building to bake all of my dog biscuits. However, I went looking around for baking mods and I did find one that I thought I would add as well uh, so that I could... I just get a text message? What's going on? Um, so that I could add uh, other items into my dog craft world. So uh, I think I can make those items. I wasn't planning on doing it today, uh, but I think I can. So I'm going to grab some eggs and then head down. Oh, hello, random Dalmatian. I want to go over and get the wolves uh, before I forget. So first off, though, let's look at the artwork that was submitted from the previous episode. We got a couple of my funeral in the graveyard for Not Pillow. This is me with all the dogs uh, mourning him and leaving flowers uh, at his grave. We will remember him fondly. <laughs> uh, this is me when my tree grew with Not Pillow up in heaven. I thought that was funny. This is Paige uh, being sick, little uh, milk toast on my head. Me at the barkery baking all of my dog biscuits. I've got a line out the door here and a creeper that wants a cookie. Look at that one of the it, that's really exactly what the building looks like and then this one I loved the tails on the D and the C so cute and then unleash the creeper sweeper because wink has that ability the rain has not stopped it is persistent so I'm gonna go ahead and sleep and hopefully I will sleep the rain away and then we can get working on this very peculiar list that Paige has given me she seems to have uh, some strong cravings for these foods and I am more than happy to uh, grant her oh I just threw an egg oh no we got a chicken we got a baby chick I didn't mean to throw an egg hello baby chicken 
Oh, welcome to the Dogcraft family. You are one in a million, or not one in mil a million, but there's a rare chance of finding a, of getting a chicken when you throw one egg, and you were the lucky duck. Wow, hello, welcome. Uh, okay, well, I'm glad that you're here. <laughs> uh, all right, I guess you can stay in the house. I don't want to I don't want to force you to not uh, To go in the coop. You're obviously a domesticated chick and you like the stairs uh, All right, let's go and you can just stay in there <laughs> uh, Oh, I just glitched back through the door. Uh, okay, so I want to go over and get the wolves and then I want to come in here into the uh, the barkery and oh, wink Wink, get out of here. He ugh, sitting right by the biscuits. Wink, come on. From the last episode. Come on. Get out. Get out. Uh, okay, so I want to go over and get the rest of the wolves. Oh, Noah brought me a fish, apparently. Thank you, Noah. Uh, he has the... Uh, what's the talent called again? Do I have any sticks on me? Let me make some sticks. And I can show you the talent that uh, Noah has that gives him the ability to bring me fish. It's the fisher dog talent. Uh, he can enter the water. I don't know how he found water around here. Uh, but he brings me fish, and I'm not going to complain. I rather like it. Uh, okay, wink, finally. Uh, Addison, Everest. And now, you guys, I bred two other dogs. We've got two dogs here. Uh, and then, of course, we've got Lizzie the Squicken. Uh, but what are these dogs' names? I remember one of them was from the Splash Pad. So I think one of them is Splat. But who is the other one? Let me know in the comments. Uh, but hello, guys. I feel like I never say hello to you guys. Let me run upstairs really quick and say hello uh, to the Frenchie family and to Doug. Hi, Doug. Hi, Celeste, Pudgy, Croissant. Oh, Croissant is in with his mother, Celeste. Uh, okay, and then let's go ahead and say hi to all of these guys. I never say hi to them. So hello guys. How are you doing? Hello, beautiful dogs. I love all my dogs. Oh, hi guys. Hello. Uh, okay, let's go and get to work on uh, Paige's request. Oh, that's right. <gasps> guys, come here. There is a pig that is in the agility course. He's been here for a couple of episodes and now this is awkward, but Paige did say that she wanted a pork pie. So I think one of the ingredients in that is obviously pork. So look away if you're squeamish about this stuff. Uh, but I'm going to hit this pig once. And then the dogs are going to do their thing. Oh, uh, let's see. Oh, he's trying to run through the gates. Oh, he didn't make it. Ooh, okay, we got some raw pork. How much did we get? Three. That's pretty good. I think that if we had, I think, did who killed the dog? Who killed the pig, actually? I was hoping for more uh, because one of them, I think Everest, has looting on him. Uh, and then Wink is supposed to cook the pork chops. So we might try this again. Oh, there's a sheep. There is a sheep on the lamb. <laughs> Are you cream? No, you're not. Uh, okay, I'm gonna hit this sheep now too, guys. There you go. I hit the sheep. Oh, the dogs can't come in. Come on, come on in. Come on, oh, oh, he's on fire. He dropped something. What did he drop? What is this? Look at this. Huh, what am I holding? Cooked lamb. <gasps> That's from the new bakery mod. All right, perfect. I've never had lamb, uh, but I guess I could try it. I'm not sure, kinda, I don't know. Um, all right, let's try to kill another pig and see if we can get Everest in on this action as well as Wink. All right, guys, so come on in and I'm gonna hit this pig. There we go. Oh, he's out. He's down. He's on fire. Oh, he dropped pork chops. Okay, so now I have three raw pork chops. So let's see how many cooked pork chops I got. Two. Okay, so I think that Everest got him. He cooked him, but he didn't. Uh, oh, guys, no, no, no. No more killing pigs. Get out of there. Um, all right, let me come and get some of the supplies that I am going to be needing. I'm going to want to milk all of these cows. And I also think I need some smooth stone. Um, anything else? Any sugar? Oh, I have two cooked pork chops in here, too. Or did I? No, wait. I just put those in there. <laughs> um, and, oh! Where's my, where's my camping lantern? 
I was so sure that I had it right there. Um, I haven't used it since the camping trip. That is odd. Uh, okay, let's go ahead and milk some of these cows if we can. Perfect. And then let's also go into uh, Damien's silo and grab some uh, wheat. I want to grab, oh, I guess I'll just bring all this wheat. And then apples, I think I need for this recipe. And then obviously all the sugar cane. We don't have a lot of sugar cane though. Oh, excuse me. Uh, okay, little hiccup. Uh, all right, guys, where are my wolves? Are they still in with the pigs? Where did they all go? Oh, they're in the silo. Come on, guys, get out of there. Silly, silly wolves. Um, all right, so let's come over, play in the splash pad a little. <laughs> Uh, all right, um, to the barkery, guys, by way of the fire hydrant. Uh, okay, so in today's episode, I'm going to be experimenting with the barkery mod. How did you get out? This is Basil. How did Basil get over here? Huh. I must have, I must have made Basil sit up. Uh, okay, into the barkery. So, let me come back over through here. And, oh, look at all the dogs coming in. Noah's my first customer. Nope, he left. I don't know where he went. Come on, guys. Biscuits for everyone, huh? Oh, some dog is hurt. There's a dog in distress. All right, he probably needs raw pork chops. So let's go find out which dog is crying. It's not Noah. Uh, guys, what are you, what's happening? Is it Basil? No, it's not. Where? Well, where are the wolves? Guys, where are you? I was just in there. I didn't see you. What are you guys doing over in this corner? This is the weirdest thing I've ever seen them do. Look at them. They've wedged themselves into this corner here. Guys, that can't be comfortable. Um, okay, I'm just going to let that, uh, let them do whatever they want. Oh. Why is there a fish right here? I'm assuming that was Noah. Uh, huh. All right, well, let's see if I run far enough. Will they teleport to me, maybe? If I run over to the bunny garden? Here they are. That was weird, guys. Um, okay, I'm gonna go ahead and eat some steak, actually. All right, so, the first order of business is to make some dough. Oh, come on in, guys. I don't mean dough like money. I mean, we actually have to make uh, raw dough for our donuts. So what we're gonna do here is we're going to craft actually let me put some stuff away in this chest probably uh, All the stuff that I don't need. I'll come back and get it later uh, Let's see here arrows my bows. I still need to combine them. I don't have enough levels again Carrots raw fish. Uh, okay, so if we put in I believe it is Did I just put the wheat in there? What am I doing? Uh, okay, so if I put in wheat, I think it's two stacks of wheat, uh, and then milk, and then eggs. Yep, this gives me balls of dough. So let's go ahead and make as many balls of dough as we can uh, with our buckets of milk. There we go, and there we go. Uh, and then let's also make a, <gasps> guys! Get off the counter! How rude! Get off the counter! Sit down! No, 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 no! You cannot be back there, Addison! Go, 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 go! No, 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 no! Shoo, shoo! Get out! Get out! Sit down, guys! Very rude! Um, okay, Addison, you can stay back here for now. Uh, I'm gonna make a rolling pin, which I believe the recipe is a stick, a stick, and a wooden plank. Yep, there we go. We got a rolling pin now and then a baking dish like this. Oh, a pie dish. Okay, perfect. Uh, okay, so let's combine the dough. Let's take the balls of dough and put them uh, like this. I think we need to save two for the, um, for the pie. So let's go ahead and make all of the others into raw donuts. And then let's go ahead and, do I have coal? I have one piece of coal. I don't think that's gonna be enough. Uh, let's go ahead and start cooking uh, our raw donuts. 
Uh, do I only have two? I thought I had three. I guess I only have two. Um, okay, so coal in there, and then if I combine... Is it getting dark? It is getting dark. Oh, okay, Wink. You've got to come outside and be the creeper sweeper. Wink has the creeper sweeper ability. So he can roam the grounds for possible creepers. Addison goes after zombies. So, okay, guys, you're my guard dogs. Guard the barkery. We're going to be in here working and baking up a storm. Uh, okay, so now my donuts are cooking. I'm going to go ahead and start on my pork pie that Paige has requested. If I combine my... Oh, no, wait. I think I have to flatten out my dough first with my rolling pin there we go and then if i combine my flattened dough with my pie dish uh-huh pie dish with flattened dough and then i should just be able to stack the pie dish with a ball of dough on top to to cover it although does it need to be flattened well we'll figure out and then we'll add the pork oh there we go a raw pork pie so let's stick that into the oven and start cooking that we've got our cooked donuts i'm gonna go ahead and uh, make some sugar and i'm gonna make one of them into a sugar donut there we go and i'm going to make another one into an apple donut which doesn't that just sound perfect this time of year an apple donut oh delicious i think Paige is going to love these uh, let's see if our pie is ready. <gasps> it is our beautiful pie. Oh, look at this, guys. We have baked. We have baked in dog craft. I'm holding a pie. Oh, look at this beautiful pie. Okay, I'm very proud of my accomplishments. Let's bring this to Paige and let's also sleep. This is like her little bedtime snack, I suppose. Uh, do you guys want to come along too? I guess you can. Um, all right. Anything guys I haven't heard I haven't heard wink growl and I haven't heard Addison going after any zombies So I think we've done an okay job of lighting the barkery up. Oh, you guys can't get out. Okay, come on uh, But we need to light up the rest of the place which leads me to something else that we're gonna talk about uh, At the end of this episode right after I give Paige her treats. Oh, hello chicky uh, Okay, so let's go ahead and sleep in our bed and then we can give Paige her donuts and her pork pie very strange demands uh, okay Paige here you go uh, pork pie and oh no I took it back uh, pork pie apple donut and sugar donut so I hope you like them I don't know uh, all right so with the remaining time in the episode, I wanted to actually talk about something that I've been meaning to do for a while, which is a road system in dog craft. And I've thought long and hard about what I want to do here. Do I have a shovel? Yes. Let's grab some sand really quick. I was trying to come up with what I could do to have a road. And the first thing that came to mind, of course, was hardened clay. However, since I'm playing on an older version of Minecraft, I don't believe that there's a mesa available here. Oh, I'm going to drown. I'm going to drown. There we go. Uh, so that I could get a lot of hardened clay. And as I, you know, as you saw from building like the, the school and the vet out of bricks, I had to do a lot of mining for clay uh, to be able to, uh, to get enough clay to make bricks. I could never get enough clay to make hardened clay like if I wanted to make like black or cyan I think cyan hardened clay is the kind of clay that uh, looks very cement like uh, however I was thinking about it and I'm not really sure that I want to build a giant road uh, I thought about other blocks I thought about stone bricks I thought about uh, wool actually like dark gray wool uh, which looks cool it just looks very industrial very much like a road and I don't know if this is necessarily this isn't a city this is my, you know, my little area. So what I was thinking was sandstone. So stay with me here. I'm going to make a bunch of it right now in the crafting table. Uh, okay. The, uh, the what I'm thinking of. Oh, no. Get out. Get out of the water. Teleport to me. Get out of the water. No, 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 no. Oh, 
oh, Noah got a fish, and none of them have, okay, none of them took damage, perfect, that was a little scary, uh, okay, so what I was thinking of with this is that it's kind of just like a pathway, right, so it would basically be like, um, like a two, I think two blocks wide, possibly three, uh, but it would be a, a pathway uh, that I would do out of the sandstone, and I feel like that could be uh, really cute. So it would be like that. I've never done a block up. I see. So it would be kind of like that. I think this is the way to go. I think what we'll do is we'll wrap this. I don't know if I like the side view of it really, um, but we'll wrap this pathway all along uh, our property. So obviously it'll come uh, past our front door. I just think that this is better to have like a small, it's like a small dirt trail, like a walking trail that you would do with your dogs um, instead of like a major road. So it would come over this way. It would go past, obviously past Squicken Beach. It would come to the docks. It would come up to, uh, to uh, Wink's Dopgark over of course to the vet and then it would really open up over here there's a whole area that i've been filling in uh where we can build you know lots of different things over here uh but then the road would continue and it would come uh i think here i think i might be clearing out some of this mountain so it would come all the way down here and it would go this way that way towards the school and there might be other buildings all along here uh, and then it would come this way uh, past the Quonset and oh, I think I left the silo uh, door open we don't want any meanies getting in here and stealing our food uh, so it would come uh, if you can see all of these are in a row so the pathway would just come down past the Quonset past Noah's Bark and then past uh, the new Barkery and that would be it. It would be just like a little walking trail uh, made out of sandstone. So let me know what you think about that. I think that that's a great thing to do. And the next episode is our 50th episode. So I think it was only appropriate that we really start to develop our dog craft world by installing a pathway. And then <laughs> for the grand finale, something that I should have done in episode one, lighting we need better lighting so if i have the pathway i will also be putting in uh, some kind of either lamppost or lighting on the ground i might have to go back to the nether in between episodes and get some more glowstone um or i could use maybe i could use redstone lamps or just torches uh possibly like they do in villages uh, but anyway that's what we will do in the next episode thank you so much for watching this episode though until next time Paige and molly love you go rescue a dog